my Corny Zen after four months of um, using it. So basically, to be honest, uh, in the last four months, I think I might use it for a month on and off. Um, in the beginning, I was using it quite a lot. But then uh, the problem became known. The problem were some units basically uh, sorted through the Bluetooth module. So then, because I didn't want um, anything to go wrong with my unit, I decided to stop using it until I had more information about it. So at some point, uh, I identified the issue, a video came out on how to fix the issue. And I have to tell you that it wasn't easy. I've already replaced the switches once, which wasn't easy at all, when I went from springs to sunsets. And I wish that I wouldn't have to switch switches again. But um, in order to do the fix for the Bluetooth module, in order not to sort, you have to uh, remove all the keycaps, switches, and unscrew the back which I have to tell you it's not easy you really need the si right size of screwdriver to do that so disassembled all the board and I applied the captain tape on this top bit behind the case so in order to avoid uh, future shots Also, since the last time, I actually finally got a new computer, so I can actually <laughs> use a Bluetooth keyboard. My old Dell computer, I don't know why, but the Bluetooth was dying all the time. So you couldn't use Bluetooth more than an hour. You had to restart your computer. There was nothing to do about it. Even if you restart the services, even nothing worked. I have to say that using the Cornizen is a really nice experience. I like the form factor, well, I was always a fan of corner keyboards, but this is chalk spaced, so it is marginally different. I'm not going to do a typing test per se, but I'm going to open the terminal. Right, so here's my terminal. Uh, and I'm going to open the door. Well, I had a session open, but that's fine. Uh, I'm going to create a new file. By the way, I'm using NeoVim with certain plugins. I mean, overall, it worth every penny. Um, it would be nice if they didn't have the problems they did, but luckily it was, they were really easy to solve. So, uh, if you ever find a unit, well, it's highly re recommended. I think the, the problem with the Bluetooth module only exists in version 3. Um, the other versions certainly did not have that issue. So, just tossing it out there if you're looking for Cornizen, keep that in mind. If you buy version 3, ask if they have applied the tape above the Bluetooth module to avoid any sorts. And um, happy typing! <laughs>